What's good with it, YouTube? It is your boy Vaughn, and as you guys can see by the title, we are back with a new video for you guys today. And in this one, we're gonna be reacting to Jack TV, girlfriend caught and exposed sleeping with her boyfriend's best friend loyalty test this actually just dropped a couple hours ago today and i've been waiting for jack to drop the next one these are always bangers drama a lot of crazy stuff going on when we watch these so if you guys enjoy these let me know in the comment section down below and the original video will always be in the description down below as well all right you guys are down there if you would like to follow me on my social medias i will greatly appreciate it and without further ado we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna dive right into this let's get it la is a fast city so setting this test will be very easy and interesting so you guys, we're currently in the airport right now. It's 6.13, the flight take off at 6.30 on the way to LA. Once we land, we will have a bit of a downtime, so that gives us enough time to, you know, rest up and stuff like that. I haven't talked to Dom, because it's a little bit early and, you know, the times are a little bit different, but we're gonna tap back in with y'all when we actually get on the flight or when we land in LA. Problem is, I don't know too many people in LA to be their decoy, but I definitely have someone in mind. What's good, bro? What up, bro? You get it? Yes, sir. All right, so look, bro, we got this guy named Dom. He basically reached out to me and wanted to put his shorty to the test because okay. she been coming to him, showing them shit on Instagram basically trying to live a lifestyle that they can't afford. Yeah. So he want to see if opportunity presented itself, would she like indulge right. type shit or whatever. So we rented out this, this Airbnb, but we're going to act like you the host of it okay. and, it's, and it's your property or whatever. So okay, when she comes in there or whatever, you know what I'm saying? You're going to basically like show her around basically what a host would do when you run right. out of Airbnb okay. and then essentially like shoot your shot at her and see if she right. wouldn't <laughs> go on a date with you. Crazy. Okay. So, I'm not, so I'm the Airbnb host? Yeah, you're the okay, Airbnb bet, host bet, or whatever. Bet, bet. So, but she think Dom rented out for her because she's trying to build a portfolio because she acts. Okay, okay. So she's using the aesthetic of the house. Right. You okay. know what I'm saying? So. However you want to do it, be yourself, you know what okay. I'm saying, and slide your shit in there, however you okay. do it. Is there anything, we don't ask this question now. <laughs> Is there anything I can dodge with? <laughs> well, we gonna ask Don when, we, when he get here. Okay, okay. Or whatever. Okay, uh, what, what, what do you want to do, but I feel you. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta keep, you gotta keep that respect, you know what I mean? Like if this is, if this is somebody's girl that you're trying to riz up, to see to catch her in an act, you definitely gotta you know filter it for oh, sure. Nobody. Uh, so literally the house niggas, is literally like right there in the hills. Okay, bet or whatever, and uh, we gonna go ahead uh, go that way once Don give me the call. Okay, tell us. Uh, My boy Jack out in LA with it right now. So what exactly happened? If you don't mind explaining. Uh, man. Um, I don't know. It's just like. I asked Dom a few questions. He got stuck. You can yeah, actually yeah, tell that he's yeah. been struggling with things in his past relationships to where he didn't really want to open up and talk about what was right. going on. Right, um, right. Like, he working as an artist. Especially up. with cameras in front of you, too. Like, like, he was somebody. That person, an artist as well. And then they get around other artists, other people. And then they see, like, clout or they see, like, money or whatever. They kind of choose that and leave you in the, in the dark and shit when you feel like Damn. locked in. So it's kind of like no. Nah, if you got a shorty like that, like she gotta go. She gotta go. Same, same, same thing going on right now. I ain't got no proof though. For sure. yeah. you know what I mean, so yeah, that's pretty much it. So basically, you explained to me uh, through the emails to me that uh, she basically was like trying to live through other people's lifestyles and and like projecting it on you because you couldn't give her a certain shit. So you yeah. felt like she was in an opportunity to where he's showing her this house and a certain lifestyle that she would go for it. Yeah. Basically, yeah, that's basically what it is, man. Like, I can't, I can't go through that again. You know what I mean? So, I'd rather just put it to the test. I respect bro for even doing it. You know, sure. so, like, bro. Like, man, peace, peace. Yes, yes, gonna be playing the decoy for today's loyalty test. Mm -hmm. Is there anything that you want? You want to explain to him that he that you don't want him to do to your girl? Yeah, like you don't want me to kiss her, touch her somewhere, a special spot, goddamn, say something. Nah, I mean. I mean, if you if you put the actions towards it and she fall for it, that give you my answer right yeah. there. You know what I mean? Type so it. that's really what it is right there. I'ma try. Hey, try, man, because All right. I need to know. Yeah. You know what I mean? I ain't trying to go through that again. So yeah. you kiss her, that's cool. <laughs> it it's not cool, but it's like if she she go for it, she falls for it. You ain't mad it, at me, time. I ain't you. mad at you. We trying to get that understanding right now, cause you know. Past, past tests, they've been going wrong. Man. So. I ain't gonna lie, kissing her is crazy. Actually, so. <laughs> nah. so he's gonna be a decoy for today's loyalty test, mm -hmm. and Ricardo don't know it, but he's gonna be the photographer for today's loyalty test. Yeah. <laughs> I bet. I bet, bet, bet. So yeah, uh, we're gonna watch everything from the bedroom upstairs. Mm -hmm. it, got a, it, got a, it got a padlock on the door, so she's not gonna be able to come inside, and uh, right. we're gonna watch everything from the camera up there and the live feed. 
All right, cool. That's cool. Right, well, cool. Hopefully, get cool. your answer today, and everything goes plan. Right on, man. Right on. Right on. Right on. Right on. Right on. All right, let's see. Let's see how this go. For some Dada reason, Dom is up to she better not kiss this man, bro. And the plan was already in play. Dom girlfriend thinks she's arriving to this Airbnb that he supposedly booked for her to shoot photos for her acting portfolio. When the whole entire time we'll be ducked off upstairs, watching her walk into her very own loyalty test. Ricardo will be playing the photographer Dom hired, while Mag will be playing our decoy in pursuit to figure out whether she's loyal or not. Cameras were set up and everything was ready. All left to do was wait for her to arrive. This is OD. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, my nigga, my nigga coming down, Mako coming down the stairs looking like Roddy Rich and shit. Hi, hello, I'm Ava. Um, my boyfriend actually booked me for a photo shoot. Okay, yeah, come on. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. 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 Uh, so my name is Mako. People call me Mako. Um, this is the spot. Um, what's your name again? Ricardo. Ricardo. Yeah. Ricardo is gonna be your photographer. He's been here for just a little while. Um, so yeah, this is the Airbnb. Um, pretty much have free range to just use whatever space uh, you need. Um, it's better, I say, I think it's better if you take pictures kind of this direction since the light comes in kind of strong, um, it's at least until the, um, the sun comes down. But um, yeah, I'm just upstairs. Um, what did you say your name was again? Ava. Ava. Nice, nice, nice to meet you. Man. Nice to meet you. Um, so yeah, I'm upstairs if you need me. Well, actually, I'll be back. Um, I'll probably just head out um, for a while. So if you need me, I think you have my number, right? I do. Okay, so yeah, if you need me, just call me um, and um, I'll be back pretty soon. Perfect, Thank Okay, you. Mm -hmm. no problem. He didn't even put it on her yet. <laughs> he didn't even put it on her yet, hold up. You should get like a lot of gigs. You said what? You should get a lot of gigs. She, she's just working right now. I mean, she on the up and coming. A lot of people like her, you know. Mm -hmm. She's very uh, passionate in her career. For sure. So, like, ain't super active right now, but she's getting there. For sure. She's getting there. That's good. Maybe sit, sit in the corner somewhere. Gotcha. Uh, you can just do whatever pose you're comfortable doing. <laughs> Before we send Mac back in to make his move, we had to make sure that mm -hmm. Ava felt like this was a real photo shoot. So Ricardo actually took a bunch of pictures, and when he was done or felt like he took enough, we sent Mac back in. Oh, I like these side views. That's crazy. I, you know what? I actually hate side view profile pictures. That's, really? You're, yeah, you're like an awesome photographer. <laughs> Appreciate it. What's up, y'all? What's up, bro? Good. Good? Yeah. Okay, I just came back to check on that. How long you been modeling for? Modeling? Yeah. Um. I don't really want to say model in okay. particular, but um, I do have like opportunities for that, so it's kind of good that I am mm -hmm. doing this photo shoot. Yeah. I've been trying to do um, more improv. Okay. But um, acting. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So. Well, you look like natural in modeling, so. Yeah. You look and then great. I just I also got me my political. Run okay. For office once, okay. So you know. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, you. You try to hit it with the. You look great. Um. <laughs> Can you give us a second? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. No. Excuse me, uh, So, acting. Um, how long have you acting? Um, I started out as a child entertainer. Okay. And then I actually ran away from improv when I was 12 because I was like a teenager. Okay. And then, now that I moved here, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. to the city. Mm -hmm. Damn, nigga. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she was loud. Um, so where are you from? Um, originally from Las Vegas. Las Vegas? And, yes, but I've been out here now for three years. What brings you to LA? Opportunity. Opportunity. Yeah, it speaks. Yeah. <laughs> Opportunity. It makes sense. I've been in LA for about a year. Um, how you liking it so far? Let me ask you before I put my opinion in there. It's different. Different? <laughs> yeah. I mean, we got a lot of things going on here every day. Is it better? Worse? I feel like I'm on the median of in-between. Okay. Okay. What about you? Uh, I like LA, but uh, at the same time, it's kind of like a little weird. I don't know. I think people are weird. You think? Yeah, I, I think I, the, feel you. I think the people are a little weird. Um, compared, to, I'm from Chicago originally, oh, okay. so like the way we act. Are oh, you from the Midwest, Midwest, like me? Okay, that's how I view, that's how I view like LA and all that too. I like Vegas. LA, don't get me wrong, but it's cool though. Other I do be I mean, thinking it's a little weird out there. Probably how, how it looks. Right. You know what I'm saying? Um, houses like this. Um, you know, I've been doing Airbnb for a while, so. Um, just see houses like this is cool. Something you don't see in Chicago, but I think I'm ready to leave. 
Yeah, and go back to your original. No, no, <laughs> I, I don't want to go back to Chicago. It's a little crazy. I, I might go. I think I'm, I'm, I'm going to move to Miami, maybe. Or maybe like the outskirts. Cool. Yeah, okay. that's what I'm looking at right now. Yeah. How's, the, how's the dating scene out here for you? The dating scene, that's very um, tough out here <laughs> for me. But not that bad. Yeah. yeah. Not that bad. Why, why not that bad? Why not good? Um, Because I don't really... I don't really get around much. You don't get around? Do you have a boyfriend? Um, I do. You do? Yeah, he sent me here. Oh, <laughs> interesting. That's your boyfriend that sent you here. Yeah. Okay, how long have you guys been dating? We want to say like a year. A Things year. are pretty good. Like, Bro, you got to go grab that fucking camera. Okay, how long have you guys been dating? Like, he kind of was going through a bunch of struggles. Okay. Like, you know, with different women that he basically had love for. Right. And everything's been going good. Sorry, just real quick. Um, but yeah, I feel like we make a good team. Like he's mm -hmm. trying to be supportive in my goals, which is really hard to get by. Yeah. And then also I'm in support of his goals. Yeah. So. What do, what does he do if you don't mind me asking? Um, he's also a filmmaker. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I hate to ask. I hate to be so far. I don't want you to think I'm just being forward, but you you caught my eye as soon as you uh walk through the door um yeah you look like a natural modeling i think you <laughs> i think you look you definitely look good we finna dive in um, and um yeah i just want to tell you that for him. i know you got a boyfriend i don't want to be too pushy uh, i don't it's not really pushy because like we're i don't want to say an open relationship but i don't think he really minds mine no. <laughs> i ain't gonna lie i don't think he minds is crazy Girl, what? Why not? What what with my boyfriend who likes his Try telling boy. you on Are y'all in love? Let me ask you that. I wanna say so. After what, a year, two years? You gotta yeah. be in love, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So why why would somebody who's in love they don't really sound natural to me? Or that's well, not natural, let's just say it don't sound like something everybody says. I don't hear that a lot. Okay, so in an open relationship, I didn't say we consented to that, but mm -hmm. um, other women talk to him because I feel like we're both flirtatious. Flirtatious? Yes, and like before what I was saying, he recently... You flirting um, with me? I am flirting with you. I okay. was going to tell you, you look like you're out of Maximac. Okay. <laughs> you know? Okay. <laughs> you, with your little bling. Mm. Yeah, it's just a little something. It's nothing too crazy. It's just no, a little something. It looks fire. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> it, it looks fire. Looks fire. It okay. looks fire. Come clap me on the on the. Is this your? Oh my God! Right here on this couch. No, let me chill. Let me chill. Like he actually had, we actually split up for two weeks, mm -hmm. and he decided that he wanted to go visit one of his girlfriends. His exes. Oh, yeah. Exes. And not necessarily an ex. They were kind of friends, but he told me that at dinner, you know, um, he actually caught feelings for her. Is that? But not an ex. Let's sit down, let's sit down, let's sit down. Yeah. Let's sit down. So, okay. And I didn't take, like, at heart because mm -hmm. he told me that he didn't want to, like, pursue a mm -hmm. relationship with her, mm -hmm. you know? Get a little closer to me, if you don't mind. All I need is an invitation. What? All no, I need is an invitation. You. I okay. know, yeah, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> But anyways, so that's kind of how we are Thank you for mm -hmm. fixing my hair. Mm -hmm. Do you want me to fix your hair? No. Are you do sure? I didn't need to get fixed? Yeah, you do. Okay. Look at that. Is something in my hair? No, just a little curly. Okay. I just okay. wanted to feel it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, so he said he caught, he told you he caught feelings for his ex again? Not an ex. So it was more of like, when you kind of split up, you kind of, you know, how mm -hmm. guys are. Yeah or however it goes, same thing for me. Some guy. Yeah, you kind of go, not on a spree, but you just kind of break free for a second mm -hmm. to kind of catch yourself. Yeah. So I'm saying like he went on that date and he basically told me that he feels something for her, okay. which kind of drew like insecurity a little bit into me. Right. Insecurity. But I completely trust him and I feel like he should trust me too. Okay. I mean, he hasn't fully said Hmm, he should trust you, but really he upstairs watching you right now and you over here getting a little touchy touchy, a little feely feely, but oh boy, yeah, I mean this is a 
open, open relationship. relationship. So. Have you talked <laughs> I mean, about it? Um, we have. I mean, he knows. Like, he even decided that his friend Jace, like, for us to, like, hook up in the bathroom at a New Year's Eve party. Really? Mm-hmm. Also, he into some freak shit. <laughs> She don't even know this dude and she's just talking like that, bro. What is she talking about? I have no fucking clue what this girl talking about. Some LA, that's, that's some L.A. shit right there. Okay. That's that L.A. shit right there. Did she say you allow somebody else to hook up with her? What's going on, man? Is that what she said? Yes, that's what she just said. And what was your response to that? Um, Actually, like we kind of did because everybody was like at a party. And <laughs> she really so she that. so she lying right now, saying that her nigga okay with her getting crashed. Hold up. Confessed and told everybody without her knowing that she had sex with her boyfriend, best friend. Right now, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, what gets me is that she said that he consented to it, which is crazy. I don't know if she's just making that up, but hopefully she is. He knew. Okay. And so I don't see, like, even if I was trying to, like, pursue you right now, mm -hmm. why would it matter? You're touching me. I am touching you I completely. Like that. I like that. Scandalous, bro. Maybe something extravagant, you know? Yeah. A helicopter I mean, to Malibu or something like that. That is way extravagant. A weekend yeah. getaway? Yeah. Me and you? Completely. I'm I'm down. Yeah, you? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, bro, we sitting up there <laughs> and watching everything unfold, and she just busts out and say that he gave her consent to be with somebody else. Okay. Sounds good. Well, let's let me give you a uh, tour of the. Uh... Yeah, I was actually about to say that. Like, I I'm like so blown away. I'm just so like I want this house. <laughs> like for real. <laughs> well, maybe you could take it. Maybe you could take it. Uh, see where me and you goes, and maybe you can. Uh, maybe this can be the weekend house or. Something like that. This is one of the uh, units that don't get booked too often. Mm. It's actually the first one in the last few weeks, so. Sweet. Yeah. And hey, let me get you to it. Yeah, let's go. Let me show you around the corner. Um, and then we can go upstairs. Can you upstairs? Why are you bringing her upstairs? You know, so is wrong. You know not to come in here, right? I tell people all the time, never freestyle when conducting these loyalty tests because now Mac forgot that we was upstairs in the room and they're literally standing right outside the door. Don't open it. Uh, you don't need to know what's behind that door. She asked about the door. I, I know they not about to come in this room, bro. <laughs> <laughs> not so not so open. What the fuck is this shit? Yo, you're scandalous as fuck, bro. How am I scandalous? <laughs> Ain't no way she just walked in the room like that, bro. Hey, no, wait, hold on. Let me rewind. Hold on. <laughs> Yo, you're scandalous as fuck, bro. How am I scandalous? This, this whole thing is fing set up. Hold it, shit, bro. All right, look, so this the whole, whole time, Don reached out to me because he wanted to put you on a loyalty test because he felt like you was just being disloyal to him for I'm a lot of reasons. Disloyal to you? This, this is what this is right now. What the fuck are you talking about this whole fing time? Wait a minute. You are telling me right now that you set something like this up and then put me on the pedestal for my career too? What the fuck do you think? Yes. Why? You're not trustworthy, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? I am, no. What do you mean? How am I not trustworthy? I watched this the whole time. Mm. So you fucked Jace. I did because you consented it on the phone. What about like last night? You texted me and literally just are you said you slow? Me. No, I'm not slow. Are you slow? You fucked my friend. Whatever. You deceitful, bro. We I told you. We, we literally heard everything from up here. If you can see, we like watching everything that y'all doing. So we You're heard you deceitful, bro. We heard you confess <laughs> and say that. <laughs> You're dirty as fuck. Man. He's just a decoy. He doesn't own his house. Everything was set up. You're dirty as fuck. You feel no, dirty as fuck, don't you? That you, would even do this you feel stupid. dirty and stupid, don't you? No, I don't feel dirty and stupid. I just can't believe. That's some like, dirty no, and stupid shit to say no, right there. Because you have like this whole fucking crew set up. You're just like putting on a show yourself right now. And you, this whole it. time, no, you've been acting this whole time. This shit. You're scandalous, and, man. And then, like, why are the cameras still rolling? You set this fake ass photographer up, and then, like, these dudes all in the background to get me with a fucking mic that's, like, picking up on me. What type of shit is that? You don't this? feel stupid, though? You fucking fail, no, bro. I don't care. This is so dumb. I cannot believe that you would. You're dirty. You're. Where you going? You're dirty as fuck, man. Why? Why do you want to talk? Why do you want to talk anymore? Listen. 
You just f***ing people, huh? So? You do it too. You f***ing people. It's trash, man. You're trash as f***, man. She, she really don't have nothing to say. Like, she really, like, is at a loss no, for words. You're trash as f***, man. When we were away for two weeks, you went with that girl. I'm and you told about. me that you caught feelings, but you weren't pursuing a relationship. And that's what you're doing to me now. Like, really? And all these mother are like following me. So you did this too? So what the f you talking about? She's a fucking liar, man. You a fucking liar, you dirty as fuck, man. Where the fuck you going? Why the fuck do you care? Jace again? Yeah, go fuck Jace again. You fucking Jace again? Who else you fucking? Just Jace. You stupid ass, you dropping your phone and shit. Oh, I'm stupid because I stupid as fuck. Go, 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 go. You stupid as fuck. Go, 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 go. You're dirty, man. And I'm glad I did this shit though. I'm glad I did this. Go. Mm -hmm. Go. <laughs> trash ass. No, you're trash. <laughs> she really not even like that. I'm gonna keep one. Jason again, huh? <laughs> I don't want to, right? Can I ask you a question, bro? Who is Jace? My friend, man. Did you tell her she could? Your homie? What? Well, I tell her to fuck my homie. He doesn't even know because he was so drunk. Hey, hey, hey. No, he was so drunk. He For didn't one? even care. For he one? didn't even care. That's what but I was see, saying. I, I, it is, this shit ain't sound right. I was just, you feel me? It's a fucking liar. You see, she, she just fell this shit right here, yeah. right? You sure. can't, can't believe shit she said. Sure. I did. What's <laughs> up? Sure. I did. She fucking scandalous. She fucking my best friend. <laughs> this fool didn't even tell me this shit. I found out just right now. Whatever. Just right now. Too bad I deleted the text, but I, it's okay. You can get away with this. It's all you guys do is just get you trash, dog. No, you trash, trash, man. Get the fuck out of here, man. To put my whole career get the fuck out of here, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go get no, the fuck out of here, man. No, I don't need to. What get the career? Fuck out of here. The career? What career? That you were supposed to support me in? I'm support. I'm gonna support you for. I've been through this shit. I ain't even into that shit, bro. I've been through this shit. That shit okay. crazy. Why the fuck I support so, like, you? Why would you like set all this up? Like for like... to catch a dumbass. Dumb ca yeah, you dumb. No, no, you're you friends, man. Yeah, don't. Scandalous fuck. Get the fuck out of here. Keep walking. Trash as fuck, bro. Hey, make sure you close that gate, gate. My bad, bro. Are you hey, good, hey, bro? I, I appreciate that, bro. Show. Like, she, I already knew this shit, bro. How how close are you and Jace? I think obviously I thought he was my best friend, but obviously I got to talk to his ass too, cause I ain't know this shit. Crazy. I ain't know this shit, so I gotta contact his ass too. What I'm not. Kind of shit is going on. Like she said, yeah, some bro. LA shit. Some LA shit, bro. Like I just went with it. Yeah. I, it was, she threw me the fuck. She fucked nah, my head. That shit bro. threw me oh, for. You just everybody scandalous, bro. Appreciate that, bro. Appreciate that, dog. Everybody scandalous, that, dog. Oh, dude, everybody bro. scandalous, bro. Like. So. Uh, she feels dumb as hey, dumb. yeah. Not gonna lie, Shorty went crazy. Okay, she's talking about she. She let his best friend crash. She lying to Waco, telling him that her boyfriend was consented to it. Yeah, she looked she look stupid. I ain't gonna lie. She looked foolish. Whatever career she got, I ain't gonna lie. This ain't gonna look good on the resume, okay? It's just not. As always, there is no video in the description down below. And while you guys are down there, if you would like to follow me on my social media links, I would greatly appreciate it. And that does it for this one. I will see you guys in the next one. We're out. Peace.